Dozens of community members with candles in hand came together Sunday to remember a young life cut short. The mother was there the whole time hugging her son. And it was just heartbreaking to see that something like that. The seven-year-old boy was killed after troopers say 19-year-old Sean Wyrich hit him while he was riding his motorcycle. It happened around 9.30 Saturday night near the intersection of Regency Park Boulevard and King Arthur Drive in Port Ritchie. I seen when, when it all happened, um, I tried to get out the vehicle um, and give the kids CPR, but somebody beat me to it. Um, I had my kids in the car. They saw everything that happened. and. They're still kind of dramatized. According to troopers, Wyrich was traveling north on Regency Park Boulevard at a high rate of speed when he struck the child. Investigators say Wyrich didn't stick around and instead left the scene. Sunday afternoon, he surrendered to police. He hit him pretty hard. As you can see, King Arms was back here, and the kid ended up a little, little ways down here. Um, so, yeah, it was, it was pretty sad. It was pretty sad. I wish that, you know, they could have stopped and at least see what happened, but they just kept going. Sunday, loved ones brought balloons and flowers to this growing memorial near the crash site. Meanwhile, Wyrich is being charged with leaving the scene of a crash involving a death, along with a charge for not having a motorcycle endorsement. This says loved ones begin to mourn a young life taken too soon. Reporting in Port Ritchie, Jordan Bowen, Fox 13 News.